Right. Hi everyone, my name is Nikita. I'm a co-founder of Pikno, and we are on a mission to develop tools which will help farmers produce more food but use less resources. Current agricultural practices are unfortunately unsustainable. Farmers are increasingly facing shortages of water and land degradation. And they need to become more efficient if they are to feed that growing population by 2050. Precision agriculture is the answer. What they can do is apply their resources much more precisely and significantly increase their yields. Uh, but for that they need to generate granular enough data and base their decision based on that data from their field and from the microclimate on the farm. And this is why we are here. Oh. And this is why we are here. We have developed a system of interconnected wireless sensors that are placed around the farm and plugged into the ground. The sensors measure solar radiation, air temperature and humidity, soil moisture, and soil electric conductivity. We have developed latest technologies ourselves. The sensors use mesh network to communicate through one another, which allows us to make the system much more flexible, plug and play devices, which you can cover any area you like. We also managed to make them five times cheaper than the closest competitor. We also developed software. You need to make sense of that data. Our software brings latest agronomics and scientific research into the hands of every farmer. By splitting the farm into sections, our, our software makes real-time advice to the farmer based on sensor data and integrated weather, weather systems. We provide very valuable insights like evapotranspiration, growing degree days, or disease models, which allows the farmer to know exactly how much water to put, when and how much to fertilize, how to avoid frost and disease, and much, much more. But if you were to go out and try to find a solution similar to ours, here's what you'll find. You'll find an unaffordable and very difficult to use system. Because the market is fragmented. As a farmer, you can buy only hardware, but that will mean that you'll have to go and manually get the data from each sensor individually. If you wanted to make them wireless, you'll have to buy a communications add-on, but that will add to the cost of the system. And if you also wanted to make sense of that data, you'll have to go to one of the emerging software companies and pay a subscription fee. We have revolutionized this model because we integrated all these parts together. Our simple business model will sell our devices at $250 each, which costs us $70 to produce, and will charge $1,000 per year per farm for our software platform. Chile alone, based on the simple business model, represents a $200 million opportunity for us. And if we go global, there, the number goes over 20 billion. I'm very excited to announce today that we're starting our first commercial pilots next week. We're going to Argentina, to one of the largest citrus producers there. And over the next few months, we'll pilot and put our system to test across different crop types, three different countries, with both researchers, uh, growers, and consultants, to make sure that we maximize the value that we bring to our customer. Our vision, however, is much bigger than that. We'll be developing sensors and actuators to automate farming process even further. And capturing the data will allow us to become the go-to information platform for governments, crop insurance providers, farm credit providers, and market participants. This is possible because we are a, an excellent team of internationally diverse hardware developers, software developers, and business professionals. And we are supported by leading universities and market players. We're raising $100,000 to get this product to commercial manufacturing. And if you want to be part of making this system available to farmers around the world, we'll be, we'd love to speak to you.
Thank you.